Was Rutger Howard a hobo with a shotgun? Well, yes, he was, but I'll tell you about it up next. Hey, everybody, hope y'all doing well today. This week's Take Two review is from 2011. It's one of my favorite movies, uh, Hobo with a Shotgun, starring the late great Rutger Howard. Uh, it's about a hobo with a shotgun. Uh, <laughs> Rutger Howard plays a hobo, and he comes into town and he's trying just to just to, you know, not be bothered, just hobo along in life, and, um, you know, he sees that this crazy family controls the town, they control the cops, they control everything, and, um, he tries, you know, he, he see he goes into this one place, and he finally snaps, because this one of the main bad guys uh, kids is really giving this prostitute a hard time and he snaps and beats the kid up well instead of um, you know when the cops come instead of taking them both to jail they just take him to jail and then they cut him up <laughs> and leave him to die out on the street anyways that prostitute helps him heal helps him get back you know to health and um, they talk about starting like a um, lawn mowing service and stuff anyways he goes to the pawn shop to buy a mower you know so he can just have a little business make his little life well these uh, thieves come in and you know there's He's looking at the mower. He really wants the mower. But then there's a shotgun. And he grabs the shotgun and he kills him. And then he just goes on a killing spree of all the bad guys' people. And then the bad guy has half the city, you know, following him after him. And there's some weird um, guys that are kind of robotic. <laughs> There's all kinds of weird, strange, quirky, fun Canadian crap in this movie. Um, if you don't like gore, blood spray, more, uh, partial nudity, um, and just weird atmospheric shit, you're probably not going to like this movie. But if you like Rutger Hauer and you like just off the wall crazy, <laughs> uh, not really a horror, but like action gore, you like this movie. Anyways, that's all I've got. We'll see y'all next week. I don't know what the four of this is the hundredth episode of this, so I'm happy I've made a hundred of these. I hope to keep making them like all the other crap I make. Anyways, we'll see y'all next time.